Adams here and welcome to my chaser. We are at the first car meet I've taken this to at Cobham Services. So let's see what people think of the chaser that everyone blatantly loves. It's going to be a busy one and we're a little bit late so people might be at the entrance waiting for us to arrive, maybe. Oh yeah, Chloe's wrapping presents. This was filmed before Christmas, it may be uploaded after Christmas. Oh look, this fridge is trying to do a sneaky one. Cheeky fridge? What is that? I don't know, what are you oh, looking at? Oh, is that a drone? Oh, is that one of the police drones? Yes, we have all oh, this GT86 with Christmas lights. So yeah, sorry if I did upload this after Christmas. This is a Christmas themed meet, hence the jumper, the attire. Shall I provide some revolutions? <laughs> Chases do. <laughs> That's why everyone loves chases, especially the, the, the this coloured one. Hey. Oh, look at the Christmas lights on the Gulf. going on the front of there's some reindeer on the front of the 370z should we park next to the mighty accord oh the swift has got the space next to the mighty accord let's go next to the swift come on bex park normally so i can fit in no bex has decided to stance park so i can't fit why is she stance parked? why is she parked her swift that way so i was going to get that space oh well let's follow mr two and see what he says oh he's going to reverse into me he's saying the only way to go is to leave so i'm going to go the wrong way yeah the golf's done the same but they're having an argument because we're going the wrong way up the road because we're going the wrong way up the road because there's no way to go back into the car park. The only way is out. So we've both decided to go the wrong way up the car park. As a result, they're having an argument. This I could give them a little toot, but then they might turn on me because I'm also going the wrong way, which is the crime of the century. Oh, there's a Yaris wanting to pull out now. A game of chess often solves many historic battles, no? Do you have a chessboard with you? Normally you've got the little mini chessboard. I do have a chessboard. You do have a chessboard? Should we offer it up? There's an MX-5 with the Christmas tree on its roof. <laughs> Out of the way. Goodbye MX-5. They've left already. Maybe they've left some nice spaces for me to go to. Should we see if Bex is parked Adam properly? Thing. It is. It's Hello. Oh my god, it's Adam Fee! Everyone loves a white toaster. Ooh. They mock, but they're correct. Oh yeah, it is. Yeah, I told you. Oh, would you look at oh. that space? Is that a space? Yeah, that's a space. You are a big barge, remember? Big boosted barge. What people don't know about me is I am the best parker in the world. So, any holes a girl. Done. So here are the aforementioned MX-5s with Christmas trees on their roof. There is copyrighted music behind me and some kind of V8 shooting some flames and Christmas lights everywhere. We're going to go to the toilet and have a look around. That chase has outdone me because he's got Christmas lights on its roof. So a goal of mine is to spot all of the Christmas decorations and this 370Z has gone to town not only with the decor but the size of the spoiler on the back. Oh yes, that's the one with the reindeer on the front as well. There's a dirty astro that says la on the number plate. So it's singing Christmas hymns. Chloe needs to finish wrapping some presents. Let's uh, unlock the car. I should have bought like Christmas lights and joined in with the Salika and the other chaser. There's a boosted EP3 driving past with some subtle sounds and bringing the year of the 300 ZX to a close is this white example. And you'll notice it says insane rather than Nissan on the badge. Nearby we also have this pink MX-5 white wheel in the world. Here is the other white chaser with its tinsel and Christmas lights on. Now the chaser behind me is actually the really dark green. They never made a black chaser, fun fact. This one hasn't got a spoiler on and that's what it looks like when you take a spoiler off. So when I eventually do that, it will look like that and need to be sanded down, filled in and blended and whatnot. He's got the lights I want, the clear ones, because I'm not a fan of the tints that I've got, but all in good time. And the armadillo exhaust needs to go. We have a 911 Turbo making his arrival, as announcements are being made about raffles and convoys. Also, this Barbie Mini has been kind of dressed up. It's got a pink Santa and tinsel too. We have all of the lights on this R33. This McGann's actually brought festive snow with it. Genuine snow, that. And a festive 350Z. Instead of Christmas lights, these hatchbacks, other than that, oh, there we go, have gone for neons. And here is the fourth Toyota Chaser of the meet. And this one also has brought some snow with it, with some sus handprints on its bonnet. A snowy Toyota a chaser in white snow on the roof as well. We've had a little bit of it recently. A frosty boy this one. This 
has the TRD kit. This is a TRD chaser. The spoiler, the body kit, the graphics too. Ah, oh, yes, there we go. More Christmas on this Golf that's pulling in just by one of the MX-5s with the Christmas tree on it. And I guess green and red are festive colours, so we have the festive drone up top. <laughs> I've just spotted one of my favourite JZX's, this JZX100 Toyota Mark II with its incredibly high visibility wrap. That is crazy. I don't think I'll do quite that with mine, as much as I'd love to. It's actually a rather busy meet. We've got more festive Subarus in the darkness. And it sounds like cars are getting ready to leave. Cars are leaving. Next up, we have another 300ZX, E36 behind, and a Lamborghini Aventador. It is a roadster, but I'm not surprised the roof is on this example. Oh, oh, oh. I was trying to shoot some flames to warm us all up now. Oh, look, we've even got a festive breakdown. The Golf is creating traffic, and in the traffic is an Audi TC. Activities of the night in a 300ZX, no less. And here once again is the most unique London black cab on the scene. Well, the only London black cab on the scene. But at the departure lounge, there's someone with a red or green light. Maybe that's a sign to say police around the corner when it's red. We've had it at green as well. Oh, it was green for the RX-8. Or maybe it's a light of approval. To test my theory, we next have a Mitsubishi Evo. It should be green for the Evo. It already is green. The Evo has been approved. GT86. Tesla's definitely getting a red light. Oh, Tesla doesn't even get anything. How about the Civic? Oh, a flash of red and red for the Civic. The police just drove past as well. They got a red light too. Oh. Supercharged Mark 2.5 MX5. Could just be a bit whiny. He got no lights. No light for him. I think the red and green festive lights have been put away. It was like a sourcing hat of some sort. Yeah, no more. No more lights for the departures. Steer there. I did hear that earlier there was a BMW that spun out here. Not great. They were playing some sexual noises from the E46. They might be leaving now for the convoy. Thank you. Soundtrack is playing from within the German BMW. Here comes the 350. Yeah! He got a subtle applause, as did the R34 four door. This mouse is still dressed up from Halloween with teeth on the front of it. And next is one of the white chases. There is a police car directly behind him, so I don't think many white chaser antics will be happening. This car's going to park up here, I reckon, or maybe try and run over everyone. Yeah, move back, move back. There we go. So we now have a permanent addition to the departure lounge and a revving Land Rover 90. <laughs> oh, update. The uh, <laughs> applause has been had because the police car just went after someone for absolutely no reason. Maybe no tax insurance. We can only guess. As a result, who knows what's going to happen with the Ford Mustang. Five litre V8. Traction on. Also approaching is this yellow headlit midnight purple. Noisy R33 skyline and a pretty eager F type V6. So there must be an opportunity to say Merry Skidmas tonight, surely. EP3 won't do MX5 or the other one. No. Oh. Merry Skidmas. I guess that counts. But I've come back.
back into the meet because I've been informed of the most festive car of the meet. I can't even work out what it is. Someone's shouting. Let's see if we can capture the festive hatchback. The festive hatch driving past neons and all. It's a Hyundai. Well done. That is amazing. It's beginning to look a whole entire lot like Christmas. He's just doing laps, showing off because he spent about 12 hours doing that. Might as well let people know as more cars depart the meet. But from the first meet in my Toyota Chaser, that was pretty much that at the Tonoshi meet at Cobham Services. So I hope you enjoyed that video. There'll be plenty more meets with this car. I'm going to one tomorrow, so make sure you hit that bell and subscribe to be notified as to when that one goes live because that will be one not to be missed so I hope you enjoyed it once again follow me on Instagram for the updates, highlights and photos I take at these memes but for now thanks for watching